Po Gun Sports, where you spin a little and win a lot. Bet, win, and pick up. And that's where the big bucks start rolling in. All right, what's up, everybody? Man, we're coming off a nice three and one day on Thursday. We're back at it once again for Friday, April 28, 2023. For your pick of the day, it's going to be in the MOB. We're going to Boston, where we got the Cleveland Guardians, minus 130 over the Boston Red Sox, over and under 79 runs. On the mound, we got Shane Bieber for the Guardians and Nick Pavetta for the Red Sox. This game come on at 7 p.m. East. All right, man, the results from yesterday's play, we had Philly over the Mariners. We had the under 8.5 between the Cubs and the Padres. We dropped the over between the Giants and the Cardinals. And our final play yesterday was the under eight and a half between the Twins and the Royals. Tonight's best play is going to be in the NBA. I do have a top play in NHL between the Stars and Minnesota. Uh, it's going to be a three-pack for sure. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to get those three plays for only 19 bucks, use code QP15 when you check out to save 15%. The link right there to those plays is on top of the comments. Make sure to man, smash that sub button, join the channel. We're in a mission. We're trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So make sure to sub, hit that bell right next to it, get the notification. Make sure to smash that like. And now uh, make sure to leave them top plays in the comments, man. I wanna know what y'all are rocking with, so drop them down below. All right, man, that's I did yesterday. The first person that dropped a comment get two days worth of my premium plays for free. That's a $40 value. So uh, make sure you hit that up, man. Let's get it. All right, uh, we got Shane Bieber on the mound, Nick Pavetta for the Red Sox. And both teams coming off rest. Uh, Cleveland just, they, they won their last game they played. And Boston coming off a loss. Now uh, this season, Shane Bieber is one and four in his five stars. And in his five stars, man, Cleveland only put up 13 runs. That's why he have a losing record because they just not giving him enough run support. And this lineup is only averaging 3.8 runs per game. And in the last seven days, it went down a full run. So the last seven, it only averaged 2.8. Now, as far as the pitching, we know Cleveland got the advantage. They always have good pitching rotation in bullpens. But for me, you know what I'm saying? When I make my stat models I in baseball, I used to use pitchers, but I think in now in time and days that the, that the hitting out, outweighs the pitching, man. And the reason why is, you know, pitchers not going deep. You know what I'm saying? We see most pitchers now, especially with that count, they they making six in his tops. You know what I'm saying? So once you get to that bullpen, you know, pretty much that, that, that uh, starting pitcher don't even uh, mount anymore. So I like the lineups better than pitchers nowadays. So it's always that's uncorrelated to some wins. If you go look at the stats right now, most teams that are on top, they uh, put up a lot of runs. You got the Tampa Bay Rays, you got the Cubs, you got the Rangers, you see what I'm saying? All them teams, they're winning because they're uh, scoring a lot of runs. And that's the reason why I like the Boston Red Sox today. Uh, they line up as putting up over five runs per game, 5.6 runs per game. Even though J.D. Martinez and Xander has left a squad, man. They still putting up a lot of runs. They're ranked number 23 on strikeouts, so they putting the ball in play a lot. And I think that Nick Pavetta will do just enough, man, to keep this Cleveland going in line up at bay, man. So, also, when I looked at the total at nine, that also kind of lets me know what the bookmakers think. They, they think it's going to be some scoring. And if it be some scoring, I think it's mostly going to come from the Red Sox. Because, like I said, man, Cleveland only putting up 2.8 runs in the last seven. Also, man, a couple more things. Uh, like I said, Cleveland just came off a win. And when they're coming off a win, they're 0-3 in their uh, last three starts. So they don't play. They don't win games mostly off those uh, wins. They always come back with a lose. And then on the other side, man, Boston is the opposite. When they when Boston coming off a loss, they're 5-0 this season. So I think the line, I think the lineup is stronger. I think Nick Pavetta do just enough, man to hold Cleveland down. And I just feel like we're gonna get this uh, nice little underdog play. Also, when the total is at nine to 9.5 and Boston is at home, they are 37 and 18 straight up. So give me the Red Sox, man, for some plus money, plus 120. That's gonna be your free pick of the day. 
for Friday, April 28, 2023. Say, man, we're getting a lot of money. Get this money with us. Pick that daily card of the day, man. 19 bucks. Save 15%. Use code QP15. All right, man, let's do it. Make sure to smash that like, sub to the channel, share these videos, follow me on Twitter at GamblingDucky1 for my extra plays I put out the other day. And if you want to contact me, man, instantly, just text me, guys. I, I won't spam you. I'm just here to really help, man, you know what I'm saying? So if I have any questions, I give out advice for free, you know what I'm saying? Especially if I don't have nothing to do with my paid plays, man. So hit me up, 214-535-3630. Hey man, let's get it. Shout out to my people. What's going on, Rivera? What's going on with you? <clears throat> Pringle, what's up, Scotty Bear? What's going on with you, KJ55 Tima? What's happening with your PP Square Productions? Hey man, let's be smart. Bear with our mind out with a hard master at Bankroll. And let's turn these tickets into cash. It's your boy, Bodun, man. Bodun Sports. Let's get it, man. Let's bear win. Pick up.